stop doing that. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. Mic check, check. Testing. Is it louder? Yeah, it's getting louder, I think. Louder? How loud can this thing get? Uh, Is this thing getting louder right now? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is that? I'm testing the mic, I thought. It's a perfect, it's a perfect intro. Dude, that was literally, it was perfect. Dude. That's the way you gotta start. Is that I you? actually already have an intro song. So yeah. We just, so we're gonna use it? We just kinda um, used it. Oh, so that was, that was the intro. Anyway, yeah. and we are live. Yeah. yeah. We are live. Is everybody, Derek's, welcome Derek. This is Derek. Wait, is dude. this a PG-13 podcast or can I swear? No, nah, dude. You can swear. Dude, who do you think we are? Fucking don't Toys R Us. <laughs> yeah, don't d- swear. On a real dude. note, don't say anything bad. Faggot. Oh! Oh, oh my god, now I'm gonna, gonna, now I'm, I'm gonna start it over, dude. I'm gonna bleep that out and make it sound like you're saying the end. No, dude, please. Yeah, yeah we have a, got you on camera. We have, a, we have a specific bleep that's just the M word. Yeah, actually. That one, we were, we were about to use that one on this one, but. <laughs> Is that young? Fat? Actually. Oh, it's a Minecraft parody, dude. I love him. Um. What the hell? Oh wait, this is the wrong one. I was expecting it to. I was expecting it to just say the N word at the end. Like. No, those are ones Nick sends me in the DM. Not for public disclosure. I already messed this up. Nick will send me like just memes of like SpongeBob. Rapping. Yeah. Alright, again, I was expecting there it to say go. the N-word at the end. It did. It did? Yeah, you gotta listen closely. You gotta rewind the podcast to hear it, but... Uh, yeah. Now we're really gonna have to bleep that out. Now we're really cooking with gasoline. Now we're fucked. <laughs> Oh if, no. If this podcast doesn't take off, guys. Where? Or fuck. You know the drill. We're fucked. What are we gonna do if it doesn't take off, dude? Like, I, I don't have a plan, dude. Like, my plan A is like podcast. I didn't come up with a plan B, dude. You were <laughs> just gonna, you were gonna wait for our podcast to blow up and just yeah, like dude. reap the benefits. Yeah, dude. Like, I realized that music wasn't gonna work out, so I decided like I should probably like just do what I'm right. like most talented at, and that's doing podcasts, dude. Yeah. Are you still coming out with new music? Yeah, I actually finally just, I said screw it, and I uploaded something. Well, it's not, it's not on the internet yet, but it'll come out on September 1st. So you gotta set it at least four weeks in the future, guys. Boom, 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 you heard it here first. <laughs> Is it gonna be, uh, techno music? No. Why not? Well, it depends on what you mean by techno, because techno mm. No, he's all literally his alternative. Really? I'm alt tech. You're bro. alt right, this whole time. Well, that too, but mostly alt tech. Bro. Alt mm. tech. Bro. Alt tech. Alt left. What's that look like? What's that look like? Alt left. Like the worst kind of woman you should be hitting up. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> like a femme cell, bro. Femme cell. What's it? What is that? I'm not from. It's like an room. incel, but it's like the female version. So like incels are men. Who are like, oh my god, I'll never get a girl. And then girls are like, oh my god, I hate men, so I'm never going to be with a man. Mm. It's like that red pill nonsense. It all evens out. Yeah, it's like red pill, but for women is what them sell is. I took both yeah. pills. Yeah, I took both, dude. Now I'm I just hate, fucking confused, Now dude. I'm gay. <laughs> I, I, I had a nightmare like that when I was at the grocery store gay? and everything was a pill. I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> what's, what's up with grocery? What's up with grocery? 
<laughs> this is wait, this is a granola bar, dude. What the hell? What's up with your dreams or just grocery store? And I wake up as a reality and just that food is pills. Sad dude. What if we are what if we are dreaming and our dreams <laughs> the dreams that we think are dreams are reality? Um no. Like uh, dude. This feels pretty real, Derek. Dude. But what does that mean? What does the word real even mean, dude? Like It's objective. Dude. Mm. So deep, dude. Deepest thing I've ever said. It's, what ob- is, it's objective. What does objective mean? It means it applies to everything. It means we've been in this reality. This is the real reality we know, so therefore it's objective. Okay. Okay. What would I say? What would you say if I said I left this reality? I'm gonna do that. Right possible. now. It's possible. Let's go. Hit the vape pen. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very bad. Dude, that nice. thing is gonna be so loud. What is that? Oh, dude, it's gonna destroy your microphone. What the fuck is that? Derek's been. <laughs> I'm gonna have to bleep this out. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> and just that. All right, and we're back. Whoa. Dude, it's so loud. <laughs> if you use a balloon, it's way louder. This is like really. This is like real life Joe Rogan podcast level shit. Right? What Literally. is that? Cream charger? No. Yeah. Dispenser. Stop doing that. <laughs> I got a cream dispenser. That's what that is. That's what I'm. Cream. Ah. It says cream charger. You just said right. <laughs> you just sprayed us all with it. All right. Yeah. Chill on the fucking. And we're back. What is this? We just edited that out. No. You just spray everyone. <laughs> it's something that you used to make your voice sound lower than it actually is. Uh, so Nick, whipped cream. Nick's like actually scared right now. I wasn't fucking paying attention. What the fuck is the cream charger, bro? Something you used to make bah, whipped cream. Bah, bah. <laughs> what? Something you used to make whipped cream with, bro. It's something used to travel to other <laughs> dimensions. That's bro. the new sound bit we're gonna use on this last bum, bum, bum. Nah, just the fucking whip. I wasn't fucking bad. Make that a MIDI. This is gonna be my white noise riser before the drop hits. That would actually go hard. NGL. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it would actually go kind of hard. But... I don't know, for some reason we mic'd a guy like just whipping a golf club, just whoosh. We committed that, so. You like the whoosh. golf club? That's, that's kind of a dope sound, dude. Whoosh. Yeah, that'd be cool snare, dude. Like a golf ball sounds sick, like a tennis ball? No, like bouncing. a golf club just smacking a tennis ball would be a cool snare. Yeah. But a tennis ball what smacking? A golf ball in midair. It would sound like right. absolutely nothing. Dude. Sent by nasty. Tiger Woods and Roger Federer on opposite ends. How do you think that would sound? You guys, you guys remember when Tiger Woods did that like controversial thing, dude? <laughs> I actually don't remember what it was. That one time. I just remember there being like he so cheated on his wife. Like, yeah. That. And he like drunk drunk. Why, why did Nike release like wave him of his contract for that? Nike be. Acting like Wait, the he cheated? Used Chinese children. The Wait, he cheated years. on his wife and Nike got got yeah. off the contract. What? They waived yeah. him I mean, for it's like not a good thing to wife. cheat on your wife, but like, what does that have to do with like? It's not like he Boston Celtics somebody. fired their head coach for cheating on his wife. What? A what? That's crazy. Really? I mean, not, like, not Joe Mazzula. Ime Ime. I mean, it's not a good thing to cheat on your wife. That but, like, guy. That guy. What does that have to do with that guy? Doesn't have a neck, bro. His head is just. Or doesn't have like a back of his neck. He's just, his, the back of his head's like part of his back. It's very weird. What? I need to see a picture of this now, do not. I need to like have audio of me freaking out when I see the picture of it in the podcast. You can lose your job for something like that. Because it looks bad on the internet. I mean, I it guess. just looks bad for you in general, but like losing your job over it, like come on. Dude. Kind of a clout move though. He probably got a lot of followers now. He's a good coach. Ooh. Why would you? I mean, like, the coach. This motherfucker. This motherfucker. Back neck. neck. He doesn't have a back neck. Oh yeah, that guy. He has a back neck. Right. I remember him coaching. I see yeah. a guy who has a throat. Nah, that doesn't make sense. No throat. He has a chest neck. His neck was so big it was like almost out to his shoulders, dude. So wide, dude. It was crazy. I was like, was probably on steroids. And he smelled too. I was like, what? It sounds like Baki. I don't know what that is. Baki build. 
Bakugan. Bakugan. Dun, dun, dun. Can we also just talk about John Cena's face and how fucking stretched his skull is? Dude. What Boy, steroids fucking You can that what you they see do? something? Steroids grow, like, it has artificial growth hormone in it, so your bones Is he grow. allowed to, uh, like, use those in, like, fights? Or is that just, like, part of the fucking, WWE? I don't either? know. No. <laughs> no. Well, wrestling's fake anyways. Something yeah, that's man. true. I like, he's just trying to look big, so he's just... I literally didn't see anything when you, like, tried to show me something right there. I transferred my... my whip it. I don't see it. anything. <laughs> I'm showing you the picture. Bing Chilling. What picture? Bing Chilling. Yeah, dude, that's what I was saying, is I didn't what see anything picture? earlier. <laughs> I can't see him. I literally... I didn't know what you were talking about earlier, because you were just... I didn't see anything. <laughs> Young fly on the track. <laughs> if y'all, y'all weren't there last night, but we were supposed to get this podcast recorded last night. <laughs> yeah, we were. And so we live near the train tracks. I mean, we live nowhere near the train tracks, but there's train tracks nearby where yeah, we live. Yeah, definitely not near the train tracks. And sometimes I just go around it because usually, like when the train stop, when the mm. train comes down, usually means it's just the train loading passengers at the station. Yeah. So like I peek to go around like the railroad thing and the, brrr, the cargo train was like right there didn't make a noise it was just <laughs> what are you being for real right I'm now? being for real I was just dying so last night wait so you just went around I tried to go right around thing? no I backed up because the fucking train was right there just the light was like <laughs> what like the things didn't go down like the no the thing things went down I just I went around oh, okay. okay I see it's such yeah. a stupid thing to do <laughs> For the podcast. Yeah. I was like, I don't fucking have time for this. So that's like the smartest thing to do, actually. I don't know why people don't do that all the time. All the time. Did you, so you just hit reverse? Or yeah, you like die, real quick. You, di- you died in the It's not like humans are naturally inclined to be afraid of death. Bro, what if you like died and like heaven's just this? You're just dun, doing dun, podcasts. Dun, 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 death dun. isn't a real thing. So what happens when you die? You just wake up back here. And you're doing it doesn't no, because by the time I death know? is a, no by the time death is upon us, we already don't exist, so therefore death doesn't exist. But you die but and then you wake up exist. and you're doing a podcast. What are you doing? Huh? You die, then you wake up and you're doing this podcast for eternity. Then we talk about what death is and if it exists or not, dude. Dude, you wanna talk about death? These nuts are death deafening. I can hear them. What? Anyway, okay. what are you doing on Monday nights? It's just deafening, but it sounded like deafening. <laughs> Monday nights, I can start doing some stand up. Monday nights? Monday nights. Where are you Where? doing stand up? Manchester. Oh, shit. Do you not I'm work not. Monday nights? No, coming up. I'm officially not working Monday nights ever again. It's a nice little low key bar that does comedy open mics. Oh! And they do pizza. Ooh. And drinks. Some oh. of the best sauce, actually. You'll ever what? Eat. Yeah. Let's go. What kind of sauces go. do you like putting your drinks, dude? <coughs> you said that you're they have high. Drinks. God, you're high. No, you said that they have drinks and sauces, dude. Like, when I hear sauce and drink together, I think, like, putting sauce in drinks. No, no, no. Pizza sauce. I know. I'm kidding. He just trolled the fuck out of you, bro. Oh, and you believed it every second. You know what kind of sauce I put in my drinks? Piss. <laughs> Monday left me broken. Tuesday I... Do you think uh, it's possible that... Uh, what song is that? Waiting for Love by Avicii. Do you think oh, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you think it's possible that that cat that sings it's real? Yeah, it's my person. cat, dude. It kind of looks like my cat. <laughs> Have you seen it? <laughs> yeah, it's my cat, bro. You have no, a, I don't know. I'll I have no idea what you're talking about. Carry this conversation. Let me uh, look up the Avicii It's one of the most cat. artfully crafted memes of the 21st century, dude. It's Is that why it sounds familiar? The first time I saw it, I, I either cried or I came in my pants. I thought Avicii I was an Asian person, turns out. Avicii's a know. black guy. No. He was an Asian person? He's a Swedish Her? man. He's a... N- Don't get <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Oh, here it is. Did you know Oprah and Stevie Wonder had the same nickname? What was it? <laughs> it was e- Nick? A-V-G-Cat. Oh. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen that. 
Tuesday. Dude, we could just do stand up in the metaverse. Yeah, dude. That's probably, honestly, that could be potentially next level comedy. Like, hilarious. Because you can say anything you want for the time being. Comedy level over 9,000. It'd be probably hilarious. Is it the metaverse, like, something AI generated? I thought. Artificial simulator? No, like VR. Like, the video you sent me. Like, people doing, like, chat rooms, but it's just stand up. Dude, AI is already taking over the universe. The internet, our collective consciousness on the internet, and the way that we all, like, fucking interact with each other on the internet has developed. It's like an entity of its own. And, like, it's already destroying us, like, from the... Ins- it's already eating humanity alive. Like, the internet. It's like the... It's like it connects all of us. But, like, especially with TikTok and, like, how China is, is like, the way they program it is so... Like, the content over here is different. It's, like... It's more divisive, it's like less positive, it's less about community, and it's more about like just people putting each other down. <laughs> that's like an entity that's like an entity in and of itself, like the like the internet. It just leaves and bad it's like, stitches every time. It's already like eating humanity alive, dude. Like the I Terminator. Don't <laughs> you don't like it? Yeah, but same. dude, how are we gonna do podcasts if we can't? It's not Skynet, bro, it's just a fucking you just ask it a question and it spits out an answer. No. Yeah, I know. I've seen those videos where they talk about it. Like, it's like, it's not really like... I'm not really talking about AI, though. I'm talking about, like, the internet, like, technology is already destroyed. The World Wide Web. Well, they say... Um, like, I get that, like, you just put shit in. It only, it can only well, operate off of, like... And it said network. that singularity is the last human invention where we start putting AI in the like, human Ray brains. Like, what, what? What's that? It's, he's the guy who coined the term singularity. Sing- like, singularity refers to like black holes. Oh, I thought you were talking about singularity. Yeah, yeah, you're but talking singularity, about singularity. But like, singularity is an AI. It would be an AI invention where we put AI in human brains and we're technically already there because we're already mm. glued to our phones. Yeah, dude. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, exactly. So, yeah, that's yeah, what I'm saying. See what so. you're but it's like, it's like the way we're so glued to our phones, it's like it's become a part of our, of our like minds, you know? So what the you're internet. saying is... It's a manifestation is... of all of, like, what we But think it's possible to live a life without internet. Yeah, that's It's true. hard. It's possible. There are definitely some fucking country-ass, big country people out there. I wasn't using the internet for a while. Or... Oh, yeah, you didn't have a phone. Uh, uh, you already uh, broke this. You already broke this one. It's a lie. That was It's cap. not brand new, buddy. Okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah it's brand new. Like, you went to Verizon yesterday, you smashed just, it. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it's I had broken. the same thought when I saw it earlier. I thought it was already broken. I was like, oh, shit. Dude, bro. guys, I get it. Everybody wants to know about my phone. But right now... I get it. I'm like, I'm talking right now. now. Right now? Look, the box... Give me a whip. <laughs> Dude. If only they could see that. If only the audience could see what we were just... Dude, if the audience saw it. Rip, rip, my girlfriend just sent me a text. They got nervous. You got a girlfriend? I've been talking about my girlfriend Wait, the last nervous? three podcasts. Where have you been? Um, That's she was sad. talking about like she was getting like spotting and she had nausea. I'm like, please don't be pregnant. Please don't be pregnant. And then I heard all I heard <laughs> all I, all I saw on my phone was wanted to officially and I was like, what? <laughs> oh shit, dude. Okay, I, I see now. I understand. No, and then she just nervous. said I want to officially say good night. I was like, Jesus Christ. Oh my God. <laughs> Please don't be pregnant. No, I just no, want to officially. No, 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 no. Let the box monster consume me. Um, no, no. Oh, let, it cons- let it consume. Let it consume all my brain cells. And I'll be left without any brain cells. I don't. Where, what happened to the father? He got consumed <laughs> by the box monster. Let the box monster consume. <laughs> uh, uh, that's the name of this episode. The box monster. Your parents come home and there's like blood everywhere, like all. And it's the just this room. thing just, in the middle. You see half my body just like sticking out of the box. <laughs> so, yeah, how the fuck does that even work? <laughs> like cramped in here, like there's open like this, or like open like this, and I'm just like it somehow stays up. <laughs> and it's just half of you. It's like containing my weight somehow. Yeah, it's like a black just get hole. Just sucked into it. Yeah, that'd be that'd be sweet. What if we just made what a black happened, hole bro? live on the? <laughs> yeah. What is that, dude? I don't know. 
Is that was that? Is There's that some like geeky a... motherfucker like you, Derek, just like on um, Logic one day. It was just bells. I'm gonna effect. soundtrack. Dun, dun, dun. I'm gonna soundtrack this fucking Minecraft TikTok. Can you do it's that? Be epic. Can we do that? And then can I go Young Fly on the track? <laughs> yeah, we can. <laughs> Make a hard ass beat clap with that. Except I won't say the N word. Oh, I just. Oh, he says the N word. So that's the emoji I keep sending you. You send me an emoji. That's the N word. So it's just. <laughs> <laughs> no, you get it? It's because. Bum, bum, bum. Fly on the track. <laughs> oh, what? No, you get it. He gets it now. You get it? Dude, that's you get it? ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ding, just spamming dong, you. Ding. <laughs> it appears multiple times. In this the is chat. mine. Uh, Baby fly on the track. Don't fly. This is mine. Okay. <laughs> the box monster. The box consume. monster. You think it's the box monster could consume the hydroplast? Oh wait 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 wait. Wait. We make a jeep out of the box monster. Wait wait. You know what we can do? We can post this episode on YouTube. Because I got the means to do it. So, now, the video is going to be just the box monster on loop. Don't stop talking. Continue that sentence. I need to hear more. Yeah, but we, we've done that. We get like six views. <laughs> Shut up, Nick. We get more views on SoundCloud. Yeah, Nick is the best. <laughs> Yeah, dude, he's right, dude, honestly. <laughs> Nick is the best. The face I mean, I mean, in the face you get more views on SoundCloud. He's the best. If only you could see Ben's face right now. Dude, it's I'm... a face dude. only a banana could love. Dude. 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 Did you know banana dude. peels have banandamide dude. in them? Dude. Wait, what? Bananamide? Banana peels have banandamide in them, and they get you fucked up. Banandamide. You know, if you take orange juice... Or if you take orange peels and put toothpaste on it and let it sit and rot for a few hours, bro, you what? It, it'll give you an acid trip, dude. That's just stupid things that people in rehab say. That's just not true. It has no scientific backing behind it. You dude, so you stuff. didn't you didn't get a lot of good prep pep talk and rehab? They just no, told no, you no. like ways to get high with toothpaste and orange <laughs> no, peels. No, that was just that was just the retarded kids who thought that. Oh, didn't mean to say a slur, everybody. Whoa, 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 hold up. Yeah, but, uh, I'm going to bleep that out yeah, again. You, it's going to make you sound that, like black. Retarded. No, but then they retarded. won't. Retarded. <laughs> retarded. <laughs> retarded. Um, no, but like, they're, they're Just words, like, people. Just words, people. Schizophrenic kids. Internet, like, fucking people. calm down. <laughs> Daddy, chill. Daddy, chill. Wait. What the hell is even that? Say it again. Yeah, what the hell is even that, dude? That video was, first time I saw the video, dude, I was like literally rolling. I've never around. seen Father, that. Father, drop your temperature. What video is that? What the fuck are you doing on my property? Get off my property. I'm probably going to get copyrighted because I keep... It's <laughs> not copyrighted, dude. <laughs> this is probably copyrighted. Dude, if someone did... It, I mean, it was it's my music. I, I wrote that. Yeah, so. that's mine. So Because uh, uh, anything they do is mine, so it's fine. Aw, I love cats. Get the hell out of New York! Hey, 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 let me have this house! Hey, let you have my house! That's so yeah, my shit! We, we, I want it! You're trespassing on my you. property! You didn't win shit in my yard! Wait, wait, wait. I, all of you! Daddy, chill. What the hell is even that? <laughs> Get everybody out! What the hell is even that, bro? He's like so wait, 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 wait. confused. Father, drop your temperature. Father, please calm down. Daddy, chill. <sighs> Opposite of mom. Please move down where it's in your energy level. <laughs> I don't know. Fucking God, go to Antarctica. Oh my God. <laughs> He's that fucking stupid. What are some jokes you've been writing, Ben? So we could do some I just came up with one right then. I'm gonna be like, you're gonna go up before me on the stand up. And then I'm gonna be like, yeah, that was Nick, yeah, man. Yeah, he's a pretty good Banana comedian, man. man. That was, yeah, Nick is the best. Dude, this no, guy. Gonna be it. Look at this, dude. It's a little bit of a guy almost dying, dude. Listen to his desperate scream. Dude, he literally almost died, dude. Like, isn't that crazy? That's a new sound, dude. Isn't that so fucking That's scary, dude? You can just tell he thinks he's gonna fucking die, like, from that. 
For those of you listening, Derek just showed us a video of this cliff climber of the who was on the rope and he disconnected the rope. Those of you that don't know, Derek just showed me literally the And the, the rope disconnected and he fell and went, Arr! Now Derek is showing me cat videos of a cat getting lint rolled. It's so <laughs> cute, dude. It's a start at the source, dude. You gotta get all the hair off the cat if you want to knock it. All right, out. Derek, we're doing a podcast, not a video cast. <laughs> Oh. oh, Derek's going off the rails. Wait, Derek's taking his shit off. Wait, I t I'll tell you a fucking joke I wrote. Um, I was going to try to work this one in. I was going to be like, yo, so... I just think it's kind of funny how people like get addicted to over-the-counter medication. You know? But it's not funny, because, you know, I know people that really struggle with that. But to me, it's kind of like, yo... About to go hit up the boys and overdose on some cough drops. You hear that? That was crickets, man. <laughs> that was crickets. <laughs> I don't know if I get it. <laughs> Alright, here's one. So, I was watching Transformers the other night. <laughs> hit me all of a sudden, man. That's Megan Fox. No, no, I don't think you're listening to Megan Fox. Okay? Fox's names aren't fucking Megan. Uh, <laughs> the box consumes uh, all. I have a bit, but I don't know how to start it, so I think I'm just going to start it off as 9-11. I got a joke. Do you... I don't know, so... Flashing back to the people who've actually lived through 9-11. Mm. Following day, it's September 12th, 2001. Okay. And your kid's hungry. Mm -hmm. Do you do the airplane? <laughs> kid starts screaming. Whoa, you're fucking... What? Too soon? <laughs> Let's if, let's discuss you're the paradigm shift. Whoa, you're America. a fucking hack. Wait, what? What? The paradigm shift? Wait, what? It shifted without me? Let's travel back to... to the good old times of learning about 9-11 in school. You know, before Derek, they patted you down at the airport? Derek, you tell break you. any weapon on a plane? Derek, you tell a joke. You'd be fine. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't have jokes, dude. I don't know how to make funny. Do be a, do tell a joke. I can't tell a joke, dude. This is like when, when Mac DeMarco was making a beat with Kenny Beats, and Kenny Beats was like, rap, and he was like, this Lasagna. Like you just can't rap. No. That's like me with jokes, dude. I just can't make a joke. Dude. Make a beat then. <laughs> oh, I actually did come up with a joke the other day when I was falling asleep, but I forget what it is. What was it? It was like not very funny. Or it was, maybe it was. What? Oh, it was it was like it's like it was really bad. It's not that funny, but it's uh -huh. like I'm everything is misogynist, sexist, that's the same thing. Racist also. Gayest. <laughs> I get it. Oh, the gayest ever. Uh, the gayest uh, faggot yeah. I've ever met yeah, in my exactly. life. Yeah, that kind of thing. See, it's not funny. But you know, it's the, it's uh, pretty funny. The lead but singer, it's like, it's just, you know, it's a kinda. The lead singer, the Matt, lead singer of the 1975, Matt Healy, has like, when they, are you familiar with the 1975? <laughs> I mean, I've heard songs by them. The only one I know is like, I always want to die sometimes. Oh, I yeah, like, I like that song. Anyway, they, before they start a song, like, he's just like, my band, oh, yeah, dude, like, my band can cut videos. me off at any time. Dude. So he's like, so anyway, Asian people. It's <laughs> so funny, dude. I'm not I like a right video. winger or anything, but. <laughs> anyway, so it's transports. So <laughs> dude, it's so funny. Oh, 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 that oh. That is funny. That is a good bit. Dude, and people, people in the comments sometimes. Is he's a comedian. Talks. He's a clown, bro. He's a clown. He's a clown. Matt Healy, you hear to hear hear folks. He's a Matt Healy is a clown, bro. Imagine being a oh, clown. Oh, oh, oh. Here's another joke. Um, why were the twin towers so hungry? Why? Because the they ordered pepperoni, but they still ate plain. Oh. But wouldn't that make them less hungry? Because they just ate fucking food, dumbass. That's why they're so hungry. But they still got plain. Yeah, but they ate fucking pizzas so they're not hungry anymore. 
I just ate a fucking we slice got of pizza. Plane. There was no a plane crashed into pizza. the building, Ben. I don't think <laughs> you were there for it. <laughs> I still remember the day that it happened when I, I was two TV. years old. I remember one. the day. We Do you to, not we read? Alive for I was alive for fucking 9 11, buddy. So were you, Derek? No, I wasn't. No, Derek oh, wasn't. Dude, I was born like a few months after that, dude. You just sucks. missed it, man. It was crazy. Was the- <laughs> <laughs> that shit was a movie, dude. dude that shit really was crazy. wild. Dude, I, remember I remember thinking being... to myself, I was like, they're coming for us. They're coming for Nick's house. <laughs> <laughs> they're coming for... They're coming, they're coming for, for my house. <laughs> <laughs> Next. <laughs> uh, it's a funny thing now, but looking back, I'm sure there was people who were actually really scared of something like that happening. True. We don't know the luxury that we are well, you having. Hear, we yeah. got condoms. Condiments. That I don't use. I don't use condiments either. So I guess life sucks. And it's a joke. Why do people like use... Like Matt Healy. Why do people use condoms? Who's Matt Healy? Oh, is that the guy, the 1975 guy? Yeah. I use a... Shit. I just spit on my hands. Oh... Shut up, dude. <laughs> that's fucking gnarly, man. Gnarly is in like that's dope, dude. No, it's no. Really, it's cool when someone spits in their hand. You spit in your hand. You shake your hands. It's like a pack. It's oh like a spit yeah, pack. yeah. HIV pack. pack. Yeah, yeah. HIV positive pack. That's right. <laughs> that just took the air out of the room, like a whippet or a balloon. It's kind of like that episode of Family Guy where like Brian has herpes. Gives Dewey herpes because they do a blood pack. <laughs> Does that actually happen? Yeah. I haven't seen that one. There's an actual episode of that. And then, Family Guy's like then so the whole time crazy. Stewie's just trolling Brian. And then like he, ha- lo- he hacked into his Facebook. Mm-hmm. Changed his profile picture to like an actual picture of herpes. <laughs> like you know it's a cartoon but it's just like actual herpes. Like it's like a, it's like it's like a microscopic <laughs> view of like a herpes bacteria or whatever the fuck it is. No. no, it's like, like boils on the skin. <laughs> Boiling. Like was it like a hyper like a. Real That's a funny photo? word, huh? Was it a real photo in Family Guy of just like? Yeah. Ugh. It's, it's <laughs> even more gross when it's like all animated, like in SpongeBob when they show the hyper realistic like close ups. Herpes shit. is pretty bad. Like it's one of the worst things. It does just look really like bad. It's not a good looking thing. Oh, damn. So you guys out. know a lot about herpes. Is there something you want to tell me? I know it very closely. Yeah, dude. I fucking I've been face to face with the heathen before. I'm like that fishing guy <laughs> who goes hunting for sea monsters. Today I came fucking face to face with death and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it can incorporate that in a bit. <laughs> yeah, that's a nasty What's thing. that guy's name? Ah, uh, fuck. Someone said it the other day. But I don't pay attention to things. <laughs> Today I came face to face. Dude, what is that guy? Itself. Fuck. I don't know. Have you seen the video on YouTube with the guy fucking stinging himself with like the most venomous ant or like a scorpion of all time? And he's like, mm. ah! And he's oh, like, yeah, yeah. That's, uh, what's his name? Dr. Payne or something? It's like Brave Wilderness or something. Oh, yeah, yeah. Brave Wilderness. Yeah. That guy's retarded. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that guy's it's like so honestly. Dumb. That guy's so stupid. Yeah, it's honestly really like so bad. bad. I, saw one, I saw one where he made a meat sock. So he made a meat sock of like raw chicken. And he stuck his feet into like a big bath of maggots. Ugh! Why would you do that, dude? Curling <laughs> between your toes and they're nibbling on the skin. Ugh! Ew. Why? I've seen that category. That's too. what it's like. Like that feeling of maggots chewing on you is probably what it's like having herpes. Dude, you know, like <laughs> podcasts don't always got to be like uncomfortable and like bad to like your psyche, you know? Like, we can, like, really heal people out here with this instead of talking about <laughs> fucking genital wars. Herpes. This is a comedy podcast, man. <laughs> yeah, Not so Derek, tell podcast. a fucking joke. A gay comedy <laughs> podcast. I don't have any jokes, dude. I'm not funny. Uh, yeah, you can borrow some of mine. She asked me how to be funny. Yeah, tell it. Like, what the hell is <laughs> Nick should... Yeah, Derek, try to read Nick's jokes and see if they're fucking actually funny. Dude, I want to find the video of the guy getting... I don't have... Those aren't complete thoughts, so he's just going to be reading a bullet list. All right, Derek. I want to find the video of Brave Wilderness stinging himself with, like, the most poisonous bee alive and just fucking sitting there screaming, like, should we give you the antidote? And he's like, no! Wait! Dude, it's so funny. 
Wait, what? Stand up. Girl, f- okay. Say it. Just read it. Guys. My girlfriend has gentle herpes. <laughs> Did spell it wrong? In other words, dude, we can have sex and the herpes won't like, Guys, it won't like mutate my DNA or whatever the, the fuck. The doctor said I have gentle herpes. <laughs> so it's no big deal. So it's, as long as it's gentle. <laughs> it won't infect good. me. Guys, I'm not funny. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, just scared. <laughs> exactly. It is. It's funny because I'm not fucking funny, dude. Guys, uh, I'm not okay. gay. <laughs> Remember when you got off the stage that one time and you're like, "Yeah, I'm gay." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was probably my best bit ever. Like while I get pussy, yeah. Well, I'm gay, <laughs> so yeah, miss me with that shit. I was making fun yeah. of this guy, and then he was like. The girls he was with were like, "Damn, dude, dude he's oh, with man. two bitches." And I was like, "Help my feet." I make fun of trans people. I, don't know. And I was like, "Oh, here's another one." That I was thinking, it's be like, just like if you're, you're talking about like people who are like have like super thin skin, they can't think a joke. You'd be like, "Grow a pair of balls." Literally, because I support trans people. Um, oh, fun, oh. But. But you say it to like, like you know, like a, like a liberal or whatever. Came up with this joke with Derek earlier. I was like, Tch. I've been hearing this phrase, male gaze, and how it's toxic <laughs> and bad for society. You don't hear anything about the female gaze. And then I'm thinking... What's wrong with me, dude? I, I'm, a, I'm gay, like, I'm fine. And then they're saying they're trying to take away my gaze rights. Another girl wanted me to dump in her no condom slash vasectomy. What? That's a <laughs> way of hell did I write that. No, this is just like bullet points. They're not complete jokes, so I'm not going to understand what the joke is. I don't understand. Like, where did you have that to train be of thought going? Where did you read that? It just has helped my female I don't friends get, pick up older Japanese I don't get, guys. Oh, yeah. Hirosh- Hiroshima blow the shit out of them. Dude, it's... Yeah. Okay. Wow. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> no, it's just funny because... It's just funny because I, nobody would understand that the is, joke. Because, that is pretty much Gen Z humor because Gen you know, Z humor literally has, makes no fucking sense. No, you have to be... You, you have to be the one to read the jokes because I don't... I don't know the context. Cause it's There's all like literally like... Points. This is what humor is now. Dude, Gen Z is like... I'm sick of our generation, dude. We're a bunch of... We need a girl pair of balls and I support trans people. <laughs> it's so stupid. This keeps us in stitches and we don't know why. No so those of you listening, it's John C. going, make the sprite wide. And then it's, Wait, he said, that's what yeah, it said. He says, that. make the sprite wide and then the sprite goes wide. <laughs> make the sprite wide. <laughs> oh, can we make a beat to that? That would be sick. I've never uh, heard a Gen Z comic. Gen Z? Gen I mean, Z I've had some Gen Z concepts. Like, sometimes I'll just, like, play shit through my phone <laughs> over the mic. <laughs> you do Like, I, I do right now. I swear you invented that. Probably. I'm like, yo. You were, like, one of the first per- <laughs> What's people up? to, like, show me shit that I just didn't understand, and it was just funny. And now I have cancer. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm a cancer. That's just, you know, how to cook a girl. <sighs> I'm going to swig this Like, <laughs> So, like, I'll just be, like, legit. Like, my ex-girlfriend has genital herpes. And then I'll just be, like... <laughs> and then people would laugh. That's Usually. true. That is true. That would be good. But that brings me comfort, because I know the next guy to sleep with her is going to end up, you know, looking like Woody from Toy Story, being, like... Somebody's poisoned the water hole! It's poisoned. Like, laugh. <laughs> <laughs> like, cause, cause you, wait, cause you like. You now that it? her vagina looks like the underside of a boat. <laughs> Why? Cause it's all like grimy. Yeah, Ugh. cause it looks like barnacles. Ugh. Does that actually happen? Can you get like, can you get like uh, barnacles. vaginal barnacles, dude? 
Ew, dude. Stop. <laughs> especially don't get down the Matrix. I especially don't get down the Matrix. It's like if some lady came in here and was like, fuck you. Wait, what is Domino, Domino Matrix? Domino, is ma- Domino's? You want Domino? There? The Domino Matrix is like guys who like bottoming sometimes. But like not with like, not like with a girl. bottoming with a girl. No, yeah. no that's like with yeah, a girl. Yeah, I, I don't get that either. That's not for me. If I'm going to be bottomed, it's going to be with another guy. I don't know, man. I saw this really hot uh, 6'2 girl. On Instagram today, and I was like, <sighs> "Was she a butch?" But there's especially guys that just like getting treated like shit. Like it's usually like CEOs, like super powerful men that don't normally get treated like shit, and then they like getting it's a kink for them mm, treated like see? shit. Oh, interesting. And then they get fucked in the ass. Mm. Yeah, see, I don't like being treated like shit. So that just if somebody's gonna treat me like shit, I'm just gonna be like. It depends you know. who's treating me like shit. I'll be like, oh. You just, mm, I should hate, I should hate it. I really should, but. Did I ever tell you the guy, the first time I tried to dominate you guys? I'm in the Matrix. Wait, what? Never mind, I didn't do that. Dude, nice joke. Yeah, we all heard it. I have a joke that's literally just like the mailman today. Called me a pussy and shoved me into a bush. (laughs) <laughs> and, then, and, then, and then it just goes just kidding that didn't actually happen and then I just continue with the next bit oh. <laughs> but it'd be funny if it did right you <laughs> get it laugh um, I had a dream the other night that I was raped by a down syndrome girl mm. and then when I tried to tell everybody no one believed me and then she just kept looking at me in the back of the room going like Oh. They're not gonna believe you. Who are they gonna believe? <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's bad. Because that funny. runs into the three R's. Apparently, there's a Bible. There's like a comedy rule that you don't run into the three R's. What's, mm-hmm. What are the three R's? Religion, retarded, retards, and racism. Rape. Yeah, racism. Oh. Is it? I feel like rape is more. That racism. means you had racism. four. No, you can joke about rape. Nobody, I feel like nobody cares. Yeah, no, I feel like joking about racism is like okay, but rape is like different. Like I never hear guys talking about rape, but I hear guys talking about race like all the time. Yeah, all these words. Have man. you seen Mark Norman before? Comedy. Yeah, dude, he's so funny, dude. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, it's comedy. a comedy uh, podcast, huh? Oh no. No, but you've seen him, right? <laughs> when he overdoses on acid. Oh no. Oh no, my Mark Norman voice. I'm on, on, I'm on the bus and I overdose with acid. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you do know who that is. The world just. <laughs> Mark Norman here. Uh, wow, I didn't realize I'd see so many people angry at a comedy show. There's a comedy show. You know how there's like different dating apps for like different things? Kevin Hart. What? You know dude? how there's like dating. This is what Mark Norman says. No, no, there's dating apps for like different things. Yes. People are into. What if I were creating some where everyone has to, so it's a dating app, but everyone has to poop right just now? That would be so hot, dude. But girls don't poop, so you never get with any girls, dude. Ooh, girls don't have like bottles. True. They don't make. Poop. I actually had this Wait, conversation what? today with my girlfriend. She was just like, "If we ever live together, you're gonna have to let me poop." And I'm like, "You're not allowed to poop." <laughs> <laughs> I refuse to. I refuse to acknowledge that you have a butthole and you create human waste. You're only. And she was like, "Well, you let me throw up," and I'm like, "Yeah." She's like, "Why is that any less gross?" And I'm just like, "Well, it's coming out of your mouth. I don't have to look at." Like, I look at your mouth every day. It doesn't disgust me. I don't look at your butthole every day. What's so wrong with girls pooping, dude? They don't do it. They just don't poop. There's nothing wrong with it. They just don't poop. Yeah. She's just, like, trolling you, bro. She's not actually going to poop. <laughs> yeah, dude. You actually believe that she's going to poop? <laughs> My elbow hurts. What do I do? I put up too many jump shots. I today. got some hydromorphone with me. I don't know what though. Uh, it sounds like a car thing, and I don't have any interest. Or maybe I should just <laughs> a car thing, hydro more. Well, here's a video of a girl pooping. This guy's right about to propose. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? An airplane? Yeah. Hell? Everyone's listening. It's dead ass quiet. And she's just loud shitting. <laughs> we're, we're not taking that out. That's staying in the podcast, dude. Nothing is leaving. I thought this was pretty funny too. When you're the lieutenant and you're being a 
attacked, but you're absolutely baked. Mm. I don't really want to find this one. Admiral Afar is a little I'm just big. Con- I was just confused. He's just... Dude, I've never seen Star Wars. That's a lie. <laughs> Got him. You wish it was. You believed it. We used to talk Star Wars in elementary school, Ben. What would you talk? What would you What would What would What would What would What would we do to talk about? <laughs> we used to talk about like Obi Wan, Anakin, like Obi Wan talk- chopping the Anakin up, and you'd be like, "That doesn't hurt." <laughs> and you'd take scissors and try to cut off your limbs. Oh my god. <laughs> just getting your bleeding limbs cut off. That doesn't hurt. That shit doesn't hurt. got cauterized immediately. Just, you know? Yeah, so it doesn't hurt. I still and believe it. burns alive. Dude, that's actually so convenient, dude, That it just automatically cauterizes the wound. Yeah, because like, it's not a tool saber. for killing. It's a tool for defending the world. We actually also had this conversation on a podcast. Like, what if they just dropped the Jedi in the middle of the next <laughs> And they just... Gr- and, and he aggroed. What would we be able to do? <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if, like, stand-up was like Skyrim and you tell a bad joke and the whole room aggros? Dude! <laughs> what does aggro mean? It means they start, they start attacking you, like, they get red blips on your radar. Video game talk, you know? Oh. You know? Oh, red blips, like, you're like, ah, Like, an ah, enemy attacks yeah. you, yeah. yeah. You start going, ooh. Like, no, like, yeah. Ooh, 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 like Halo. Ooh, ooh. You beat Halo on all legendary mode yet? Yeah, you get Derek? the special cutscenes. I haven't played Halo before. What? So why'd you think the lore cast was cool? The what? Let's turn this into a lore cast, bro. <laughs> yeah, we should just talk about Halo. With about... Derek, who's never played it before. So my opinion on Halo is that it is a very... Have you played any video game? Sophisticated game. Have you played any video game, Derek? Yeah. I used to play a lot of Mario Nintendo games. So you're a Nintendo boy? You look like a Nintendo boy. Oh, <laughs> so roasted. But I also liked yeah. other games like Geometry Dash. And Geometry Mario Dash? Yeah. yeah, dude, I was a famous... I was on the creator, creator leaderboards. Dude. Is that a Nintendo game? No. Or is that like a computer it's game? It's an independent developer. Yo, deadass. The best video game I ever played was like Dora Racing. I used to like come home every day from fucking... Fucking <laughs> place of door racing. I used fucking. to come home every day from Wait, door racing? Dora. Dora. Dora Dora racing. The Explorer. It's like Mario Kart, but it's like Dora. But it's like it's a free it used to be like a free website. You Dude, I remember, it and it's like I remember. a 3D game on a website. I'm like, That's how is this cool. possible? I didn't think 3D imaging was possible. Oh wait, dude, I think I website. played that fucking game too. Door Racing, the 3D one? Yeah. Dude, yeah. It was I like a website like, you could go to. What the fuck is this? After I was done looking at porn in first grade, I would play some <laughs> Door Racing. <laughs> did, you guys ever, did you guys ever play Madagascar cards? Have you, oh. seen, um, have you seen that new guy on Hello? Kill Tony? Cam Patterson? Yeah. The black guy? Dora Car Racing? Yeah. I think that's what it was called. Cam Patterson's I funny. like that bit where he's talking about like his older brother's telling him it's just like you can you, you can never date a white bitch mm-hmm. you can fuck a white bitch <sighs> stick your dick in her mouth cum in her mouth but you can never date a white bitch and I'm like yeah that made sense but I was only six years old <laughs> I butchered that whole bit but you know no, he's, he's funny, funny man. you're not he's funny what's your job today I'm a stare <laughs> Oh yeah, that's pretty funny. He's pretty good. I ain't retarded or nothing, but I like rocks. <laughs> but I like rocks. Yeah, I remember that. That was funny. His last two kill Tony's were the ones I've seen. Dude, stop reloading that. Yeah, dude. No, I'm not reloading. So I like airsoft CO two. <laughs> stop shooting me with that shit. I remember where little Cole shot me with airsoft CO two. Can you hear me? That box just right in your face. Right in my ass. Like he pulled out. He pulled. shot me with CO two point blank in my asshole. And now I'm gay. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm like this. Because every story has a fucking lore to it. Every scar has a fucking lesson and a reason. Every rose has its thorns. That's 
So I just have non-stop hemorrhoids. Just a slow motion of fucking coal shooting in the ass. <laughs> Alright. I think we just did this shit. Alright, as the roosters have come to roost. The roosters have come to roost. This was a good one. The roosters have come to roost. Go uh, pre-save Derek's song. Yeah, uh, yeah Derek, Derek, what is that, song. by the way? Where, where can we find that? Again? Anywhere. But you can, pre- you can pre-save it on Spotify. Mm. What's it called, Derek? It's called Ordinary Lovers. But it's not on YouTube, because it hasn't come out yet. It's Ordinary Lovers. Pre-save by... now. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it. I wasn't fucking bad. I wasn't fucking bad. <laughs> oh, I hear it now. I hear it. We're definitely going to have to close the podcast. <laughs> Blue for you. Way to pause it. Episode. Blue for Lou, go stream. Alright. Something in